Hey, what's up, YouTube? It is Gary with Thick Skinned RC back uh, finally with an update on the Gen 7 and on the portal axles. Um, before we get started, I, I did have the top gear on one of the portal axles break um, before this video. Uh, Red Cat's support was great and had me a new gear within, I don't know, it's like three days or so. Um, since then, I haven't had any breakage and I've put, I think, three packs through it. Um, the break that I had, it was semi-bound, it's on the backyard course, and um, I can't fault it too much for that one. Um, I would have obviously preferred if it didn't break, but um, it, it was kind of a dicey um, spot for it anyways. Um, but uh, on to the good stuff. Um, really impressed with how the portals did um, out in Lano. I uh, went out with ATX crawlers and was running this one when the other guys were running their 2-2 rigs. Um, a few wraiths and a uh, custom rig. Um, the only time I had any problems was really the width of the rig itself. Um, sometimes it just needed to be a little bit wider to follow the 2-2 uh, the rigs around. Um, those AR-60s on the wraiths are Know, pretty wide and um, a couple of gaps I just couldn't quite make it across and ended up rolling into them but um, break over angle definitely seems better ground clearance overall is definitely better with it um, didn't really have a problem with it being top heavy obviously the body is now pretty light but I, I didn't you know side hilling wasn't really a problem with it um, I have no complaints. Uh, I have some tweaking to do on the body, had some you know, rubbing here and there, but um, all in all, I really couldn't be happy with the performance of it. The uh, electronics are still the Hobby Wing uh, sensor brushless, 17 or 13.5 turn, um, one of the two. Tires are the Super Swampers, uh, KMC wheels, and in this video is actually still the stock servo. Um, body is the 66 Pro Line body meant for the deadbolt and a 12 inch wheelbase. Uh, I'm right about 12 inch or 12.1 inch for the wheelbase so I need to shorten it a little bit um, probably pull the front in but um, speed is about the only complaint I have now after the force. There it is. Um, I, I knew what it, I, I knew it would happen um, obviously there's some gear reduction um, with the portals but um, I, I need to gear it up a little bit. On 3S, I can just about keep up with it full throttle, and I got close to draining my first pack um, on a relatively short, you know, two and a half hour crawl session. Um, and I run 5,200 mAh batteries usually, so. Um, anyways, yeah, no, no major complaints. The second gear is holding up um, after that first one, and Red Cat actually has a new design out that beefs up that gear quite a bit. I think it'll solve any. Um, breakage issues that you wouldn't really, you know, expect something to break in. So I'll go ahead and stop yapping and let y'all enjoy the portal powers on the uh, Gen 7. And as always, we appreciate y'all watching and your support. And remember to hit that like and subscribe if you haven't. Check us out on Facebook and Instagram as well. Thanks, y'all.